Former President Olusegun Obasanjo adds his voice to calls for the prioritization of innovation in the development of university curricula to give the Nigerian graduate a chance to compete in a knowledge-driven global economy. Chairman, you, you can say that, sir. The former president asserts that Nigerians must not settle to merely join the global race to the top, but rather prepare to win it. In a dynamic society, in a dynamic situation, is that the curriculum must be innovated, invigorated, re-engineered, and be made dynamic. How to turn intention into reality is the focus of experts who say that while insufficient resources, corruption and inadequate practical infrastructure to equip students militates against the pursuit of innovation in tertiary institutions, dynamic teachers can make up lost ground. So the lecturer has been given this, he has transformed this into his or her concert line and he goes on to take the thing. At the end of a long day, when the course is over, what the students take out finally is the achieved curriculum. Vice chancellors present say that adaptive curricula must tally with local advantages and realities. You know, we are in the uh, in the heart of the Niger Delta with so much ecological challenge. We do have uh, programs that are this dynamic in areas of ecological uh, studies and management. Universities are supposed to now build in their peculiarities into their curriculum to fit in with the context in which the university is located. Well, thank you very much. As academicians pursue consensus to forge ahead, Nigerian students abroad prove that when given support, they are among the best in the world. Ajuri Ngilale, Channels Television News.